On the final day of Pope Benedict's state visit to Britain, the pontiff spoke more personally about growing up in Nazi Germany than he ever had before. For me as one who lived and suffered through the dark days of the Nazi regime in Germany, it is deeply moving to be here with you on this occasion and to recall how many of your fellow, fellow citizens sacrificed their lives, courageously resisting the forces of that evil ideology. Benedict was forced to join the Hitler Youth and later served in the army before deserting. His comments also marked the 70th anniversary of the Battle of Britain. Nazi bombers and fighters attacked the British mainland during the Blitz. My thoughts go in particular to nearby Coventry, which suffered such heavy bombardment and massive loss of life. During an open-air mass, the Pope also beatified Cardinal John Henry Newman. The 19th century convert from Anglicanism was enormously influential in both the Anglican and Catholic churches. By our apostolic authority, we declare that the venerable servant of God, Cardinal John Henry Newman, priest of the Congregation of the Oratory, shall henceforth be invoked as blessed. The Pope's visit has been met by protests. On Saturday, Benedict met victims of molestation by priests. He said he was ashamed by such unspeakable crimes. Police, meanwhile, released six men who were arrested on suspicion of plotting an attack against the Pope. The men were freed without being charged. Police said searches had not uncovered any weapons or suspicious material. Matt Friedman, The Associated Press.